Triforce is calling. We have a quest to finish. Welcome to a new Let's Play, or rather the conclusion of an old Let's Play. One started before I even did the Phoenix Wright games and got as many subscribers as I did now. Let's play Legend of Zelda Oracle of Ages. The companion to the Oracle of, to Oracle of Seasons. Now, the interesting thing about this is I want to do a linked game. So let's put in a secret here. Let's go... No. This should work. If I had figured this out back then, I would have done it way back then. But... Honestly, when I played this game as a kid, when I played these games as a kid, I did not know how these secrets worked. I used a link cable, link cable to do the linked game, which I'm trying to do here. I never did any of the optional secrets, so I never got any of the ultimate weapons, the ultimate upgrades. We're gonna be doing all of that this playthrough. I guarantee ya. So we will be going back to Oracle of Seasons, occasionally, to get some secrets. Okay, now. 7, 5, N, F7, yes! Alright, notice we start out with four hearts, so let's begin! E I remember this music. I know that, that's Twin Rova. Onyx, General of Darkness. Twin Rover will not let your death go to waste. Behold. We saw this at the end of Oracle of Seasons. The flame of destruction is lit. When sorrow and despair burst into flame, we will offer up the sacrifice, and the dark rites of the Gerudo will be complete. Then Ganon shall return. So obviously this half of the quest will end up lighting the flame of sorrow. So then what will light the third flame of despair? Alright, fine, I suppose we'll accept your quest. What will light the third flame of despair? We shall find out. Now. Help! Holy fuzz. Oh my. Yes, we scare them up because we're so macho. You're welcome. Yes, it is. Okay. Hello, Imba. Good to see you again. She asked you to find a singer named Nehru. Oh, very well. Looking rather blue today, Impa. If only time could stop, be careful what you wish for, my friend. Soon more animals come? What's this? A giant rock with a triangle on it. What's it? A sign. Okay. I suppose. Eh? Yeah. Are you alright, Impa? So Nehru's house is up here. Let's move the rock. If you've seen the remix that I posted a few videos back, this is the original. This is the song that made me fall in love with this game as a kid. And there she is. Now, everyone has one, like, movie character, actor, video game character that they've fallen in love with. When I was a kid, this was the first game where I ever really fell in love with a character. How charming. Indeed. Huh? That she is. Now, ah, thank you. Let the 
person. It is enchanting. There she is. That's Nehru. I'm not ashamed to admit she's the first video game character I've ever really fallen in love with, so to speak. Impa and Don. And who are you? Oh yes, you're Ralph. I never liked Ralph when I played this game as a kid, but, well, he's he's a bit of a douche, but he means well. Many evil troubles? It's nice to meet you, Nero. Approaching. Impa? Why is evil music playing? Why are you laughing? Impa? Oracle of Ages. Oh, fuzz. Whoa, spinning. Okay, this is bad. Hello there, Miss Shade. Oh, wait, you were joking. Duran, Sorceress of Shadows. This can't be good. So why are you after... What do you... Oh, God. Oh, God. Look out, Nehru. No, 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 don't dodge. No, no. Oh. Oh great, now Nehru's evil. Ralph? That's not a good idea. Indeed. So now we got a really big problem. Oh great. Traveling through time? No, don't go. The Age of Darkness. Oh, fuck. What are you doing? Going to the past. Oh, great. So Varane's going... Varane's off to go fuck up the past. Uh-oh. Ah! Turn him into an old man? Uh oh. I think you're making them go extinct. Uh oh. Where? Did you just turn to stone? I don't know how you pull that off from the past, but. Now what? Don't blame me, pal. Oh. Even though you're a bit u useless, you mean well, and I'll give you credit for that. And... Off he goes. Oh, Impa. Congratulations, Impa, you just ruined the world. How do you feel? Yeah, who would have thunk it? Indeed you have. Indeed. Now this world has been severely screwed up. just screwing with the past just for the hell of it. First I'll drum, now Labrina. Sweet. Can we go
go meet the Meku tree. So, Labrina has a Meku tree too. Alright. Notice we already have the wooden sword. So, we're a bit well off. Starting out here. And now. Now, we're off to meet the Meku tree. So, first off. Welcome to the Brenna Village. This is the... Is that the old man? Ow. Ow, that hurt. So, we don't have a seed satchel yet. That could be a problem. Anyways. The gate's closed. Okay. Well then. Ah, Hero's Cave. We're not gonna go in here yet. Normally, we'd go in there first, but we'll go in Mako Road instead. In the late game, uh, Hero's Cave actually becomes a really much more expansive dungeon with the special reward at the end. I'm not entirely sure what the reward is in uh, ages, but we'll get to that eventually. Anyways, hello, Mako Tree. Nice to meet you, too. Okay. Flooding this world with the power of sorrow. Well, we heard about that. The flame of sorrow. Need something... What? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. You're raving. This can't be good. Stop raving. You're also raving. In the past. Uh... Oh, crap. Don't tell me the Mako tree got killed off in the past. Well, when we return, will we find our way to the past? And can we save the Mako tree? <laughs>